distribute reports by email, you need to set up your SMTP parameters, including outgoing mail server address, port number, and username and password if the server requires authentication. Insert a default sender email address and click Update Email Settings. Next, create a task to distribute your report by email. Create a new task, fill in the name, and select an app from the drop-down list. When your task has been created, choose the report you want to send by email, select the output format, and make sure the checkbox attached to email is checked. Select the users or group to whom you want to send the report. Select the Email Destination checkbox to send the report to the selected recipients. If you want to send filtered information, select your previously created filter from the list. The Destinations tab allows you to customize how reports will be delivered to each user and group. Now you can customize your email message. To customize the sender's email, either choose from the drop-down list or enter a valid email address in the custom field. You can also add email addresses to the CC and BCC fields. Separate email addresses with a semicolon, then enter the email subject. Select the email format. If you want to add tags to create dynamic text, or select HTML. To insert dynamic text, click Tags, and then select the tag you want from the list. It will be replaced with a value when the email is generated. If you have other reports related to this task, you can add them as attachments. You can create a trigger to schedule when the task is run, or you can run this task manually. Once your report has been sent, the user will receive an email with the report you've selected as an email attachment. And that concludes this video. Thanks for watching.